like we've seen quite a few times. Oh yeah, recently Knight's been going Ryu uh, against Big Mac because uh, I think he's afraid that Big Mac downloaded his Rosa, but uh, he gained confidence in, in his Rosa again, so let's see how that's going to work out for him. Yeah, he wants to keep it in practice. Do you know if Knight's going to Genesis? Uh, no, he is not. Uh, the only ones that are going to Genesis from GG are Dan and uh, JJ. Big Mac going for the side B off stage, or the down B off stage there. Um, interesting choice when they went that far into the blast zone. Honestly, another fair might have just killed Rosa. They were really far off to the side. I think he just wanted the damage, though. Uh, I mean, Rosa could recover from a really far away place. Well, and it, again, it, he's trying to ledge guard. I think he's going to try to do a lot of ledge guards right now. Well, going for the down B gave Rosa the opportunity to air dodge, which obviously the fair does not um, when you get deep enough into it. Oh, that was a nice landing. Uh, Luma landing, Luma landing. Oh, like that. <laughs> So it's a, it's a little tech. Yep. Right now they're pretty even, but I think right now, since Knight has the advantage in percent, even if they were tied up, because Rosa has the way better kill power, uh, he's winning. He's winning by a lot. Yeah, definitely. And Sheik being one of the few characters that can actually get in on Rosa's um, way that the character is between having Luma and being very defensive of a character, even though Knight being one of the more aggressive uh, Rosalina players out there. Um, having a percent lead against Sheik is always super important in this matchup. Right, Big Mac wisely waited out the air dodge and got that back air in. Uh, just trying to rack up percent, get him within uh, the Big Mac special, the uh, down throw up air kill that he goes for more than any Sheik player I've ever seen. Ooh, that was a nice recovery. That was right in for the vanish. Interesting. Down I kind throw. of ran out see the up air. Oh, he, that was a really, that, that was a miss input. Uh, I don't think he got a second jump off. Just straight up goes for the down B, trying to catch the shield poke. Down throw, up air, not quite. Ooh, but the Luma is going to send him away, giving him stage control. Yeah, super important here. Ooh, goes for the up tilt. Right, he, just, or, he has too much rage. Tilt, up air. Ooh, lands right on him and gets hit by that up smash. All right, so Knight's got a little bit of a lead here. Oh, uh, yeah. Do you guys know, or do you know these guys' career record? Um, like who usually wins this set? I think it's very back and forth, honestly. I think Knight does have a few uh, sets over him, but it's not like it's it's a really big difference. It might be like maybe a three game difference. Okay. Every once in a while, you find those top players where like one guy just has a mental block on, a, on another one. Yeah. Ooh. Big Mac missing these down throw droppers, but he's gonna hit him with that bouncing fish. Gonna reset that. Uh, Knight didn't get that much extra credit. Now he's gonna go in, gonna take a little bit more damage. 45% already. Nice air dodge. Until you get hit on that first stock, it's all extra credit. Oh yeah. There we go. 52%. Big Mac is having trouble going in again. Big Mac doesn't often just down throw into down B. And against Rose, I can't imagine that's the worst option. I mean, it'll, I'm pretty sure it will take out the Luma, but it, it'll leave you in a bad position if um, the Rosa could land. I mean, she is floating, so I, I can see that being a good option. Doesn't he kick over Luma to kick Rosa in the face? I believe so. So it at least knocks Rosa away. Oh, Big Mac just missing these follow-ups. Big Mac? It's a really weird play by Big Mac. He's not... He's not landing his follow-ups. No, he is not on his game as well as he usually is. Um, but give it a little bit of time. He oh, might yeah. be able to turn it around here. Oh, that was nice jab, jab once in there. Especially with Rage in this game, it's not over till you're actually dead. Oh, yeah. He's going for that yellow up smash. All right. Pretty sure he has a jump. There's his jump. He's going to land right next to him. But he does have the Luma covering his landing. Right. And there it is. I'm pretty sure he thought he was going to have his Luma. His Luma is down. Right now it's Big Mac's time, uh, his opportunity to go in and take out Knight's nice stock, or at least do a really big amount. Oh, there it is. Oh, oh he went yeah. for the Vanish. But you know what? He has gotten the percent up, and now this is a last hit, last stock situation. Ooh, that was a good idea to go for the up air from Knight. Fair almost killing. Rosa is so light. Both these characters, not very heavy. Oh, no. And for good reason. They're very strong characters as it is. Oh, good and the shield. Luma took the the Luma took the hit. That was just a meat shield right there. Uh, I w did the Luma barely respond like as soon as he sent off the bouncing fish, or was it already there? Because I I didn't see it. I don't think he saw it either. I think he was just like, you know, we're going for this. Yeah. 
All right, that was a that was a really close match. Big Mac almost brought that back. Um, actually, I don't even think it was bringing it back. It was just a lot of back and forth action going on right there. Yes. Yeah. Well, we're gonna have a go. game two. They're gonna go straight back to Smashville. All right. All right. I would also. All right. Game two, Smashville. Just taking it right back. Catching nice sitting in shield. There go that fair sending him backwards. Knight yeah. can't go in. Knight, <laughs> he's just putting up a fair wall. He can't go in. Yeah, um, Big Mac getting a little bit more of a lead this game than the last time. Uh, coming out of the gate a lot stronger. Playing a little bit more patient, it looks like. Just trying to get in there at the right times with the right frames. Trying to shield poke. Fares, um, wisely fares Luma off stage and now uh, Knight is Lumalus and taking quite a bit of damage from Sheik. Yeah, he needs to get out of, out of that platform right now. All right, there we go. All right, his Luma is back. Big Mac playing really patient, but he's going to get caught on that roll. Yeah, only, only 30 damage so far, though. Uh, Knight's got a lot of work to do here. And Big Mac is trying to juggle him, keeping him out. Keeping him out. Yeah, Big Mac is definitely playing way more patient in this game. He's not going in, he's just getting what he wants to get, and he just goes back out and waits for a Knight to approach. Yeah, and with like him having that percent lead, uh, that's a really smart thing for him to do. Looks like that last game uh, made him change a little bit. Okay, so um, Big Mac gets rid of Rosa Ooh. and catches her with the air dodge vanish. Yeah. It's basically a coin flip against Sheik. Like, if you air dodge immediately, if you don't air dodge immediately, you might get up aired. And if you do, you might get vanished. It's hard, like, to not know once you get grabbed that 50% of the time you could just be dead. <laughs> yeah. Knight definitely really behind. Now, without that rage, he's not going to be able to uh, seal the stock as easily. Uh, Big Mac just sitting back, taking his punishes when he. When he uh, there we could. go. Down throw into down B. Get the damage in. All right, there's the jab. All right, so Big Mac, yeah, definitely running the setback. It's looking like um, Knight has a huge uphill battle. Again, the rest jab of this game. two to Nair. Really good option by Knight. Big Mac back on stage though. He's really got to finish off the stock before too much damage gets racked, gets racked up. Because a Sheik with Rage on Smashville, not really where you want to be. Yeah, he's just kneeling out. Even if he doesn't hit Knight uh, due to the shielding. Oh, Ooh, Luma. Hello. hello. He is going to make it back, though. But yeah. like I was saying, even though he only hits Knight's shield with the needles, the needles are going to keep hitting the Luma, uh, giving him an opportunity once the Luma dies from needle damage. But he's going to get that stop with that up smash. And okay. now we're going to see up till that was 21 damage from that uh, throw combo. Big Mac was shaking his head on that last kill. He, up he threw out a rogue up smash, and I think what he meant to do was up tilt. OK. That, that's. Ooh, ouch. Oh, that, that was a really scary spot to be. This game is basically even now all of a sudden. Oh, yeah. I mean, he only ha he has 70% on Knight, but that's really nothing when you have uh, Rosa with Rage. Definitely more effective than uh, Sheik with Rage until you get to like the, uh, the down throw up air uh, kill confirm. But that Luma is going to be taken out. Knight at 93%. 97. Big yeah. If Knight can survive until he gets back Luma for a little bit, um, then he might be okay. All right, uh, nice jump. All right, Hizuma is back. Ooh, that was scary. Good grab. All right, sending him off stage. He does have the advantage right here. Big Man keeps just uh, up being onto his face, and it, it gives him so much free damage and uh, control. Yeah, it's hard to uh, ledge guard Sheik. You never know if he's going to go uh, like on the ledge or if he's going to go just right into Rose's face. And like to throw up shield instead of edge guarding has to feel awful. Oh, yeah. Oh, and up he's going to get hit by that. smash that. He's going to take that stock. The rage is going to help him out. All right, uh, close games. Um, but it looks like I'm up next, so I'll see you guys later. All right, Demidas, always good.